Good afternoon and welcome back to the vlog. That is an empty Pringle box right there. We're just gonna go down there. I guess technically it's Ken. Anyways, it is like 10 to 2. I did not just wake up. I promise you that. I woke up at like 8.40 and I woke up. I had to pee and my arm was like, hello. <laughs> I am here. And I was like, oh yeah, you are. And so I'm really glad I decided not to go to work today because Yesterday my arm hurt when I was doing, today my arm exists and hurts, so we've um, stepped up to that next level. Uh, also, like, I had to sleep on my right side last night, I usually switch between the two, and so my hips hurt when I woke up, and I'm just getting old, basically, <laughs> is what I'm saying, but yeah, it's like, that hurts now, whereas yesterday I could get, like, up to, like, here before it started to hurt, so love that, love that, and also just in general, like I said, existing walking down the stairs. Arm hurts. <laughs> um, other than that, no symptoms at all. Totally fine. Life is fine. Everything's great. <laughs> um, so uh, the only problem is like, you know, I use arms when I do things. <laughs> and so it definitely does make um, trying to decide. Oh, oh, nope, not good. Um, I try and decide what to do today a little bit harder because my plan initially yesterday, because I was like, <sighs> I'm gonna be fine. I'm not gonna have any effects. I'm just going overkill for no reason, which I mean, kind of. Um, <laughs> but the thing was, I, I didn't, the, the sore arm was like something that just completely escaped my, my thought process of something I'd have to deal with. So the plan had been to cut fabric, but I need to put a lot of pressure with my left hand onto the ruler and the fabric in order to cut so I don't know if I can so I don't know maybe we'll like embroider or something or maybe we'll just continue doing nothing today although technically I did already edit a vlog this morning and I've got another one ready to go we're slowly slowly getting there but yeah so that's about where we're at today my mom is getting her vaccine and then a couple hours later her boyfriend is getting his vaccine so that is very exciting i told them that pizza would be a great dinner option tonight because it's a one-handed thing because <laughs> last night i had um uh, we had leftover roast beef so i had like a beef dip and um yeah two-handed you don't think about it but it's a thing <laughs> so yeah so we'll see uh what's for dinner but yeah like i said it's currently 10 to 2 I think my mom's appointment is at like five to four and then his appointment is at like quarter after five I think if I recall correctly so I think I'm just gonna putter and chill and see where the day takes me and how I feel like I probably I probably could have gone into work honestly I just like I was saying in the last vlog I would have been super ineffective and kind of useless I'm gonna go into more regardless I said even if I have to feel like a one-armed pirate as I wander about which is great because I had some supplies delivered they arrived yesterday <laughs> and I have to move them from where they are so that might be a fun endeavor <laughs> but we, we shall see anyways I'm gonna maybe watch a YouTube video because like I haven't even watched any YouTube videos today I've just been like socializing and puttering and eating and so yeah we'll we'll ease into the day further I would love to cut fabric though I think that's like that'd be my ideal ideal I already know better 24k got nothing on me make you want it forever try to play a game but you don't play for keeps messing with a girl from the east side yeah kind of love you want to build your dreams on yeah but i already know better i'm a go getter and i got me i'm good i'm head over shoes on hardwood for me you know i wrote the book i'm moving along from somebody wrong Go ahead, tell me all the ways you miss it How you want me back in your bed But I'm not around for hearing you out uh, I gave it so much honestly and you closed the door Alrighty, well there's been a bit of a pause in me being productive because as you saw I was doing all the cutting of the things because uh, my mom had her vaccine and then I think after they got home, her boyfriend had to go back like an hour later for his vaccine. And my mom was like, oh yeah, feeling like a little nauseous and a little bit like lightheaded slash dizzy. And then she's like, 
and like my vision's a little blurry but I don't know if that's just because I need to get my my prescription checked in my glasses or if it's from the vaccine and I'm like that is not <laughs> a side effect of the vaccine you got it's on the sheet for AstraZeneca if you get it but we didn't get AstraZeneca and so I'm like because it was so hard to get her to take her vaccine so I'm like is she just trying to make this a thing <laughs> so anyways um because she wasn't feeling the greatest when her boyfriend went to get his vaccine I stayed downstairs and I sat with her just in case and also to make her keep sitting down because she's like literally I look over and she's got a sponge and she's like scrubbing the wall and I'm like what are you doing oh well I saw dirt I'm like it would still be there tomorrow well it was bugging me now well it's probably been there for like a week and a half <sighs> driving me nuts anyways <laughs> they are both back now he's totally fine uh, my arm is still like anything over this hurts Although, like, depending on how I lift it, like, this is fine, but this, anyways, anyways, I did get some mail today because I bought a bunch of stuff on Etsy, and this, oh, that's great, it is tangled already, and this I got is a mask chain, so you can wear your mask around your neck, um, which will be ideal for Blind Channel because I'm gonna have to wear my mask regularly, like, when I'm at the theater, I hardly have to wear it because there's, like, hardly other people around, um, but this will be nice and it's got these cute little hearts on it very adorable although like allegedly assuming everything goes to plan as of july 1st uh, masks indoors in bc will be optional still recommend it but optional and i'm like well that's what the government's saying but companies can certainly set their own opinions and ideas and for sure out in blind channel i'm sure it'll be a mask situation so we shall see. But anyways, I think, like, I've got all of these cut, and I can't reach them, and I'm too lazy to get up, but I have a bunch of dog handkerchief things <laughs> cut there, and then I have this fabric still, and this fabric that I think I want to cut some handkerchiefs in. Wow, could you focus? There we go, this one, and that one. Um, maybe, I don't know, I'm kind of lazy now. <laughs> <laughs> and I did actually email my one boss about these are the things that I have to sell do you think they would sell well in the store blah 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 these are the prices I'm thinking etc 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 so that's where we're at anyways I'm gonna put something on to watch and um I'm gonna cut some more stuff even though I'm being lazy I'm gonna cut some more stuff and then I'm gonna do a heck of a lot of ironing <laughs> Okay, so it's about quarter after nine. My hair, my poor hair, <laughs> because my arm hurts, putting my hair up properly is just like, it's an effort in pain, and so I just really don't care that much. But I think my plan is going to be to finish these guys, because they're all pinned, and they've got the clips on them, and they are ready to go. So I'm going to finish all these guys. I might finish those gray ones over there, assuming I can make it work. I don't really have enough thread for that, so yeah. And then I think I'll probably sew these guys, just the flat bit, and then maybe iron them and press the sides. But we'll see how it goes. The The only thing that I for sure want to get done are these tealy green ones because they've been sitting there for some time and also they're um, taking up a lot of my clips <laughs> and um, I would like them back. Alrighty, so as planned, I did finish the lanyards and the teal uh, wristlets and then, um, nothing else. <laughs> well, I did download 
a bunch of my sewing patterns that I've purchased. I've <laughs> like 31 or 32, like I got a problem. I've printed four of them and not made a single one. <laughs> I bought fabric for one of them and then I was like mm, I don't know if I like that fabric for that so anyways um it's like one o'clock <laughs> I'm the worst after like <laughs> what I was off like Saturday Sunday Monday Tuesday in a five-day weekend okay <laughs> life's hard I'm getting back to sleep I just slept when I wanted to and it was fantastic and so now I gotta try to get to sleep here shortly oh also remember like a couple weeks ago I was mentioning this game called Parking Jam that I was super obsessed with. Well, I there's only like 200 challenge levels and I had completed all of them except a couple here and there that I had gotten frustrated with and given up on and so I just went through and I finished them all so I guess technically I've completely beat that game. <laughs> so I think that means I should just delete it now and um, then we'll be okay because oh I will still keep playing it I'm at like level 6,000 because I just keep going and playing and playing and I really don't need to I I did pay for the ad free version though other than if you failed a challenge level you had to watch an ad there's nothing you do there but rather than like every like three things you had to watch an ad so like I paid four bucks for the game and it was so worth it I spent so much time on that game <sighs> I got problems but I should probably start getting ready for bed now. I'll just show you my situation over here. So I have this bin here that has all my completed wristlets and the lanyards. And then I have this one that has all the two sew ones, the um, handkerchiefs, and then also the finished handkerchiefs because I don't really know where to put them. <sighs> I'm probably going to sew tomorrow, which is why I left this out. And we got a bit of a mess because I still haven't put my clothes away. They're still in my hamper under the bed. <laughs> but for the most part, we're doing all right. I definitely, I need to figure out what to do with that cricket. <laughs> oh, that's bright. <laughs> there we go. What to do with the cricket and the um, cardstock that I have <laughs> because they're really taking up a lot of space. But maybe that's a tomorrow task or something. For now, though, I'm going to try to get to sleep because I do work in the morning. Um, and good news, I, th oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my god! It's okay! Oh, yes. There's still like a couple, there's a little, anyways, there's this little tinge in one spot that I hit, but you know what? Oh, it's basically okay. Oh, that feels so great. I wonder if I can sleep on it tonight. Arguably, yes. Okay, that's great news. I'm gonna go to sleep. I'll see you in the morning. Alrighty, we are back at the theater. It has been a long five days since I've been away, but I am here. I think somebody left the heat on because it is so warm in here, but you know, we will survive. First thing when I came in though, I saw the products that I ordered and I mentioned, and I was like, that doesn't seem right. And I ordered six of something and they sent me 12. And I was like, did I, did I screw that up? Because they put in a new ordering system a couple months ago and I had to go to like a seminar to learn how to use it and it's like the most useless difficult ordering system I had ever seen like it sucked before it wasn't great before but now it's just like it brings me great stress anytime I have to order anything I hate it I hate it I hate it I hate it and so I was like maybe it was me but I checked my receipt or my like the um order sheet that I sent in Nope, it was them. They sent me 12 of something they only needed six of, so that's fun. I mean, we'll still use it. It'll just be there for a long time, so I mean, I guess it's a win. Anyways, I'm gonna... Oh, I'm melting. I'm gonna have to take off my sweatshirt right away before I even start work, and I'm gonna have my breakfast drink, and then I'm gonna get this day started. I think there's actually gonna be a couple people here today, which is very exciting. Um, it's Thursday, so usually at least a couple techs are here, and then my um, boss is gonna be here too, so... <laughs> Ooh, socializing after spending like five days at home alone. Although I would like to continue that sleeping in thing that I was, do blah, 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 that I was doing. It was fantastic, but uh, maybe a nap later. If nothing else, I'm pretty sure I'm off on Saturday. Oh, do I work Saturday this week? Maybe I work Saturday this week. I do work Saturday. Oh, well, that's fine. I had five days off in a row. I can work three in a row, I think. It was a very aggravating day today at work with my boss. Like, for someone who's normally pretty good and pretty chill and who I don't see very regularly because of COVID, man, within seconds, he did something that annoyed me and then it just kept going downhill. But I'm home now, which is 
great. Very happy for that. And it is currently quarter to one. I'm hungry, but I have no idea what I want. And I've like gone through the fridge and the freezer and the shelves and stuff. And I just like, nothing is like, eat me, eat me. And so I'm just going to chill for a bit and hopefully something, I'll start to crave something because I just like, I just don't want anything. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend a little bit of time editing um, some more vlogs because I think Saturday is when I'm planning on putting out the first one. So at minimum, I need to get a um, thumbnail done for that. It, it's edited and exported and the one from the following day is also edited and exported, but no thumbnails ready to go. So I'll probably edit the next vlog and then maybe export those two because I have another two if I finish this one, that'll be done. And then we can start uploading. I think that's really gonna be the plan for the next couple days is just a big push on the um, the editing of the vlogs. Also, my arm is still pretty good even after working all day, like a little bit, but nothing like it was yesterday. So that's good. Anyways, I'm gonna get to this and I will uh, check in with you after I have hopefully successfully edited this vlog. I am grooving right now. You probably can't hear it. Um, listening to Artlist music because we got a subscription. And also with going out to Blind Channel soon, I want to refresh my music and have some new things. Like I definitely have some that I go back to time after time and like some that are specific. Like I'm like, I am doing X, therefore it's this vibe. But I'm actually like, I regularly find new music that I really like and it's great because there's like this explore page here where it just kind of tells you shows you the newest stuff I think that's where I am oh here we go um and you can just kind of go through and then you can go by like mood uplifting epic powerful whatever whatever you want and it's it's really nice I do find sometimes that I'll be like I am looking for specifically this and it'll be like no we don't have that but it's just the search feature like the user interface is relatively good but I'd say it needs a little bit of work also not sponsored <laughs> um just really like it it's actually funny because the vlog I just edited I um talked a lot about Artlist too again it's just because I like it but speaking of that vlog I ended up actually being further along in editing than I thought I was I thought I had I had the first second done, that's one vlog, and the third and fourth done, and I thought I had the fifth and sixth done, but not edited, and so I was working on the eighth and ninth, but I was actually on the twelfth and thirteenth. <laughs> I'm just saying a lot of numbers, I'm rain manning it here, uh, which is still like two weeks ago, <laughs> but I think that puts me at like five that are ready to mostly go up, save the thumbnail. Again, the thumbnail is something I'm going to have to work on. Slowly working on it for sure, but I think what I'm going to do is maybe just vibe for a bit. The song I was listening to called The Vibe. Uh, vibe for a bit, download some music, and export the couple that I do have done, and try to grab the screenshots for the thumbnails, and then maybe tomorrow I'll focus as a thumbnail day, but watching through this vlog, I mentioned that I wanted to go through my closet and get, and get rid of a bunch of tank tops, because I just got a couple new ones that I really like, and also I want to sew today, but I think the one thing I'm really gonna try to do today is this. I'm gonna try to get rid of this box and this bag, the, the cardstock and the Cricut. Find somewhere to put them. Because right now I feel like my room is always a mess because it's just always out there regardless, no matter what I do. So, uh, I think, okay, okay. I should make a list, but I think laundry away, go through closet, home for Cricut, and friends, <laughs> and then sewing. I think that's all I should plan for today. Oh, invoicing, invoicing. It's only quarter to two, so I have a lot of time to do things. So I'm gonna go through a couple more songs because like, honestly, I get stuck here for hours just do grooving and trying to find music. Uh, go through a couple more songs and then switch focus. And then later tonight, assuming all goes well, we'll get to sewing. That, that, the sewing is the fun thing that I'm enjoying a lot right now. So it's not work, it's just a lot of fun. Something that should have taken me a very short time, in fact, took me a very long time because I got distracted by Sweet Home Alabama. <laughs> 
I like, I turned on my TV to put on Psych because I've seen it a million times before, so I can just have it on in the background. And the first thing that popped up on my recommend it was Sweet Home Alabama, and I was like, yeah, okay. So it took me freaking ages, but I got all my clothes put away. I went through my clothes and I pulled out like a decent size bag. I mean, it's not full by any means, but that's still like probably like 15 items. And excuse the sewing machine. Look, I found a place for the Cricut and also just behind that Kleenex box is where I managed to stuff the cord stock, cord stock, card stock. So that's very exciting, but still have a little ways to go, but we're getting there. I like these things, eh. <laughs> but it's 4.30 now, so it was extremely painful. I even stopped and did my hair. Like it just, it was not quick, That that's for sure. I did manage to export another vlog. I think I still have two more to export and then uh, like another six to edit. It can't be that many, can it? Is it that many still? Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, this one's the sixth one. So yeah, it is in fact that many still. So we're getting there slowly. I even got my tripod out because I was like, I'll take some time lapse of me doing stuff. And um, yeah, just just wasn't a thing anyways. I'm gonna go see what the plans are for dinner because it's just my mom and I tonight because her boyfriend has to work. And then um, I think I'll probably whip out the sewing machine and do some sewing. I also, yesterday, oh my goodness, I have like one slipper on and one slipper off and I can't make up my mind. So I saw this fabric and I was like, oh, that'd be a really cute fabric for either, could you focus? There we go. For either uh, like handkerchiefs for dogs or for like the little wristlets. And then I didn't even realize I still had this fabric. I thought I used it all. So I'll probably make some more wristlets out of that. Very exciting. But that's where we're currently at. That's, <laughs> that's the update. Oh, I can't, like I've just literally just been here. Just been here. <laughs> I am exhausted all of a sudden like I just had dinner and now it's 20 after 7 and I'm just doing like the head nod I have not done nearly as much as I was hoping to do with the sewing machine here um I sewed all the bandanas across so I'm gonna have to da -da 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 -da. I'm going to have to get out my ironing board and my iron and then press them and then press them and fold them and stuff. So that's for another day, but I knew that kind of when I started them. I did get these set six, six of these ones done with the anchor pattern, which it doesn't want to focus, but that's fine. I still have to cut the thread, but not pressing. And I'm now working on these ones with this anchor pattern. Would love for you to focus. They don't have enough hands. They don't have enough hands. Hello, friend? Friend? There it is. With this anchor pattern, which is slightly different from the other anchor pattern. Um, and so I've got these three done and I have another three oh, to sew the edges on. And then I think I'm gonna call it on sewing at least for the near future. There we go, that's the one. I was like, far future? No, because I do have to do invoicing as well tonight. So I'm going to finish these three and then lock into invoicing, see how I feel. And then maybe, just maybe the sleepy girl will go to sleep at a reasonable time. I would love, honestly, if I could climb into bed at like 9, 9.30 and just pass out. I would love nothing more than that. That's the goal. We shall see. I know I've said this like a million times before, like, oh, I'm so tired, I'm gonna go to sleep, but I'm so tired, I'm gonna try to go to sleep very shortly here. I just finished invoicing, it is now 22 9. It is raining outside, it's like a miserable, it's, it's not a miserable day. I mean, it kind of is, but it's like the perfect day to climb into bed with a book or a movie and just snuggle with your newly repaired teddy bear. <laughs> and, um, hopefully go to sleep early so I'm gonna try doing that I intentionally left my overhead light off in hopes that I wouldn't really like wake up and seemingly it's done the trick I just gotta take my hair out which I regret putting up now because these elastics while super cute for hairstyles just such a pain to get out and I also need to get a haircut because that's looking damaged anyways that's it for me for this week and um 
hopefully I get to sleep quickly, and I will see you on the next weekend vlog. Good night.